Welcome to the first episode of the Robert Cassio Show. What are you looking at, butthead? I have no idea what I'm doing, and I don't care. Sitting next to me is my furry little co-host, Sir Thomas. Say hello, Sir Thomas. No? Uh, well, I guess he's a little mic shy tonight. Before we go any further, I would like to give a shout out to the website darkmatterxm.com. For all your paranormal needs, get lost in the dark at darkmatterxm.com. Well, now a new story, uh, Friday, for those of you who might not know, was the 50th anniversary of the killing of President John F. Kennedy by unknown parties. No matter what your personal theory is on the JFK killing, we must take the time to reflect the killing of a man who wanted to end the Federal Reserve. Yes, he did have many personal problems, um, many uh, physical issues and issues in the home, but uh, deep down he wanted the, the best for people, and we must uh, remember him on that day remember what happened in Dallas and hopefully one day we will learn the truth and the real uh, truth will be out and we will finally have closure but until then we can do nothing but speculate. For the most part there, uh, there was no incidences at Daly Plaza. Um, during the event, but at the end there was a slight incident between the Dallas Sheriff's Department who had a influence from a federal agency and the in the crew of Infowars.com and Alex Jones and uh, many people who were with him had a small incident of possible police brutality, but at this time, um, we are not really sure what what had occurred. It appeared that they allowed them into an area just so that way they could kick them out, or that the local police let them in, but then the feds decided to remove them. But it was it was a very confusing situation, and, and more information will be released at, uh, soon. In other news, there has been a slight development uh, over at ArtBell.com. ArtBell is now um, playing podcasts uh, through ArtBell.com um, from various sources. Um, but with Art himself, it seems like we have a wait for him to get uh, release from his serious um, serious contract, and that is coming up in about a year and probably 10, 10 11 months from now. But until then, uh, ArtBell.com uh, has became a kind of hub for a couple of paranormal radio shows. Uh, feel free to check that out at artbell.com. Whoa, whoa, whoa. In other news, Florida police accused of racial profiling after stopping a man 258 times, charging him with trespassing at work. In the last four years, Earl Simpson, 28, has been questioned by police 258 times, searched more than 100 times, and jailed 
56 times and arrested and transported 62 times. The majority of these citations occurred at his place of work, Miami Grocers Convenience Store, where he works and where the owner says police are racially profiling him. This is, uh, this is a, just another um, fine example of the police state. Um, this man works at this place and they just see him and uh, they arrest him for, for, tr for trespassing at a place that he works. Um, that's very, that's very thuggish. And I, uh, hope these guys get fired. But, um, knowing the way that, uh, <clears throat> that it works, that they'll, they'll, they'll be punished hard with a week off, paid, paid, and probably a racial sensitive, r racial sensitivity class that will be, <laughs> A daunting hour and a half of um, lectures, and uh, they'll uh, probably have to bowl last in the uh, in the police bowling team. So uh, they'll definitely learn their lesson there. You're listening to the Robert Cassio Show. Robert Cassio Show, and we'll be back after this commercial break. Hail the most beautiful. They reveal their secret to shine. Every morning, I shampoo. Umaga pala, fabulous na. Iba talaga eh. Para every strand is so healthy. Sobrang love ko smelling it, touching it, and so does everyone else. And how my hair shines? Oh, wow! Vain ba? Wait till you've tried it. Feeling jo sa karen. Obviously, I give extra effort in taking care of myself. It's a pro-vitamin formula that makes a difference. That's why the hair shines more. When your hair looks just perfect, you shine. And when you shine, you know you can do anything. Only one can give all the shine I need. That's Pantene. Only Pantene. Shepherd Pantene. Always Pantene. What do these most beautiful women have in common? They all love Pantene. Believe you can. Shine. Pantene. Are you troubled by strange noises in the middle of the night? Do you experience feelings of dread in your basement or attic? Have you or any of your family ever seen a spook, specter, or ghost? If the answer is yes, then don't wait another minute. Pick up your phone and call the professionals. Go Ghostbusters. Ghostbusters! Our courteous and efficient staff is on call 24 hours a day to serve all your supernatural elimination needs. We're ready to believe you! Good Cassio Show. Well, hello, welcome back to the Robert Cassio Show. I am your host, Robert Cassio. Now, I know I did say that this was probably going to be an hour, but it probably won't be. Um, this is the uh, first episode. I don't um, run out of things to say. I've already ran out of things to say. But I will try to think of more things to say. You're listening to the Robert Cassio Show. Japan warns unpredictable events over China's new air zone. Tokyo, Japan warned Sunday of the dangers of unex unpredictable events, and South Korea voiced regret following China's decision of an air defense zone over areas claimed by Tokyo and Seoul. Foreign Minister s said that his country was considering making a strong protest at higher levels. Well, you know, <clears throat> it's not good to be flying over other people's air zones. Just, could you imagine that? Just the people flying over your air zones all the time like that? Is it 
buzz, 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 zip, 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 flying over and doing airplane stuff just flying right over you and that story was from japantoday.com well I think that this is going to be the end of the first episode of the Robert Cassio show um I think that it went pretty well what do you think uh Leave a, leave a comment below, and uh, I'll uh, get back to you. But um, no troll comments, please. Any troll comment will be rightly ignored, and you will be shaved by a monkey. Well, that's all. Good night, folks. Holy, holy guacamole this is just a small little addendum that this program stinks I'm not even gonna say what it is it's still it's difficult and it sucks and it makes me want to cry but maybe I'm just too stupid to use it anyways goodbye